Talk about tennis gateway on the smiling coast, enjoying the country's great attraction while helping to inspire in sports. Spending time in the Gambia is a worthy cause for the Dutch international and tennis national team coach Bas Collier, who frequent this tennis facility during his holidays to train with local players and coaches yeah. in the Gambia. The Dutch manager's presence yeah. is a rare opportunity for these aspiring tennis players and coaches being introduced to new skills by the top tennis technician. Today's training session focuses on footwork, enhancing movement for players during matches. Actually nothing with the record, but more how you prepare before you hit the ball. Because you have maybe the best forehand or backhand in the world, but if you're not moving well, or you're not, moving the, the, you're not using the good movement, then your best forehand is not, is not going well. So uh, that's what I actually in this short time, I'm uh, trying to, uh, to teach them. After direct engagement with local players and coaches, Coach Bass is hopeful that if required support is provided, Gambia will make a name in the game of tennis. They can play. Even the facilities are not good, but they can play. So uh, uh, for sure, if they can play more, for example, there are four courts and they don't have to wait till others are uh, uh, ready, but they can anytime go to a court. For example, they have four courts over here. Then I was thinking then uh, the, the improvement is much more and maybe Gambia can uh, make a, a role in the tennis in West Africa. There is always something to learn during these times as these youngsters get exposed to more on-court techniques Tennis has a long history in the Gambia, but the country is yet to make a real breakthrough in the game, which is becoming increasingly popular among young people. Pass has been a great help to the Gambia Tennis Association when it comes to equipment and the kind of training that he's given to us. So we all benefited from his training because he's given us a top standard training of a top coach like him, so it's a great privilege for all of us and we all have benefited from his training. It's always about money, because um, um, if, you, if you have a bit more money, maybe there are two courts more possible, you know? Maybe uh, a coach can uh, add to Philip, maybe also to work six days in the week or whatever. They can practice twice a day instead of once. You know, it's all about that. And now what I see every time if I'm coming here, it's like a lot of people practicing. Sometimes even with kids, there are 12 or 20 people, but all the same on two courts, you know? Well, if you have four courts, you can, you can, uh, you can play with two players. A delightful walk in vacation playing tennis makes Coach Bass' holiday a unique one. He is looking forward to continue his support to the Gambia Tennis Association. Mudlamin Sane, GRT Sports.